happy oh, tonight. Man. <laughs> uh, we're going to have maybe some heat lamps on this weekend as well. Yeah, we're going to see another dip down after a pretty nice Saturday for sure. Another storm system sort of zeroing in on Arizona, but a bit of good news for northern AZ and the White Mountains. You're going to get about 18 to 24 hours of a break from much in the way of snow after we get to sunrise tomorrow morning because overnight tonight we still could see a little bit more snow uh, anywhere between four and six inches for the Flagstaff area a little bit less. It looks like along the muggy on rim, but six inches right now appears to be the top end of what could fall overnight and there's a slight chance for a few measurable showers around the valley. If we get anything, it'll probably be north of town and uh, pretty sporadic at that. So let's check out uh, what's happening on Doppler radar. First alert radar. You can see some heavy Heavier precipitation now in northern portions of Mojave County. Uh, generally speaking, just light snow showers around Flagstaff tonight, though the winds are still up, so the roads are still nasty and impassable in some areas because the snow was just blowing across the roads, keeping them hazardous. Uh, for the most part, it looks like there's not much snow along the State Route 260 corridor right now. But again, our radar has its limitations over in the White Mountains for the valley. Just a few light sprinkles of possibility. These heavier light showers, if you will, over in western Arizona don't appear to be headed our way. Uh, winds tomorrow are going to be down as well. We'll see them uh, kind of calm, in fact, but we'll still have some air moving around. After a high today of only 61 degrees, 72 was average. The record on this date, 89, goes back to 1989. And right now we're at 56. Winds out of the southwest and the dew point is at 32 degrees. So around the city, it's 50 at Cave Creek, 54 at Scottsdale, 54 as well at Maryvale, Glendale at 51, and south of town Maricopa at 52 degrees. All right, the rest of tonight, maybe a few light showers. Overnight low of about 46 degrees. Tomorrow, we're going to turn mostly sunny. So if we don't get any rain by, say, 7 to 8 o'clock, ain't going to happen. We'll see a fair amount of sunshine. Temperatures in the upper 60s. Then our first alert seven day forecast. More of the same for Saturday, though becoming breezy Saturday afternoon. Then that chance for overnight showers into Sunday morning. Sunday, we dip down again to about 58 degrees and next week looks like it could be a little drier. All right, Royal, thanks.